YouTube, the man of the hour is here, Victor Wabiyama, a.k.a. Big Vic. Look, before we get started, man, let me tell y'all this, man. We got Victor Wabiyama in the game uh, the, the, through the miracle of PC and all of that good stuff. Got him here. Looks like him and all that good stuff, man. But make sure before we get started, make sure you like the video and comment Big Vic or Waving Yama in the comment section at the end of your comment and all that good stuff, man. Let me tell you why. Because every single week, we give away $50 in cash out or $50 in VC. You do not have to be a sub in order to do this. All you got to do, comment Waving Yama or Big Vic down below. We're going to choose a video at random. And, uh, you know, like I said, it, it, the more videos you watch and comment on, the more chances you have to win. But uh, you can comment on this one, and you might have a chance to win that one. Also, we're giving away at the end of the month, if we can average 10,000 views on each video, we're giving away a next-gen console. So if for Christmas time, man, you might, you might, this might be a very Merry Christmas for you. You might, you might get a, uh, you might get a PlayStation 5 or an Xbox, whichever you want. And uh, you can thank good old St. Vic instead of uh, St. Nick, man. But like I said, through the miracle of PC, we got this guy here, man. Um, and we're going we gonna to play a game. I got him at Power 4 because uh, he's against Giannis. Um, I wanted to be against Giannis because it makes for a better video. Also, he said out his own mouth that he's six, uh, he's seven three. We made him seven four with shoes on because it makes for a better video and better clickbait anyway, man. And also, two hundred and nine pounds. That boy real thin, but look at it, boy. His, his hands are almost at his knees. That boy can tie his shoes standing up. And just like Grandma said, he could probably dunk the ball uh, without even jumping. But look. Offense, we just took straight up Kevin Durant skill set and we modified it some. We gave him more standing dunk, more driving dunk. Everything else we pretty much kept the same. Uh, up upgraded his defense a little bit and all that stuff, man. But like I said, make sure you like the video. Comment down below for your chance to win a next-gen console and or 50 bucks, which we give away every week regardless of anything that happened, man. And uh, other than that, enjoy the video. Here's the starting group for the Milwaukee Bucks. Giannis and Lopez are the bigs. Matthews and Middleton on the wing, and it's Holiday in at the one. And for the Hawks, Young runs point with Murray at the two. Then it's DeAndre Hunter. Then there's John Collins, and it's Mr. Clutch in at the four. So the Bucks win the tip. Holiday against Young. Pass to Matthews. Now Holiday. Here's Ana de Kumpo. Collins with the rebound. Well, Brent seems like every year the Bucks have to replace a key rotation player. Yeah, and tricky because they don't have the financial wherewithal to spend a ton of money with the contracts that have been given out. So it's about the right fit, the right personnel, and I think front office and coaching staff do a great job of identifying who those players are. Now here's Middleton. Over Murray. Here's Lopez. Always a nice way to start. Makes his first one. Good size and the ability to carve out space. Lopez battling on the rebound. Outside Murray. Outside Hunter. Clock at six. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. And DeAndre Hunter is still just a young talent here in the league, but in college, he was a champ, winning the trophy in 2019. Having a national championship at the collegiate level is rarer than you think for an NBA player. Well, it puts him in great company, and it's pretty much guaranteed proof of why everyone was so interested in his progress. He's a winner, and he's got tons of potential. That free throw misses. You know, before they moved to Atlanta, the Hawks had a lot of playoff success. They made the NBA Finals four times in their first 12 years, and they won a championship, Brent. Yeah, recent years haven't been as kind, but they're getting back in the mix there, and it's been a half century since they've gotten to the Finals. They have some, they have some special players on this team, and the Hawks fans are, are really desperate to see them compete at that level again. Yeah, you could throw that pass just about anywhere, even the top of the square for Giannis to go and get. Inside, here's Collins. The rebound by the Bucks. And he gets a lot of points right there at the rim, but the defense determined not to give up the easy deuce there. Here's Anadokounmpo. Drops in the layup for two. 
Antetokounmpo has gotten his second bucket. That's fun to see the handles coming out there from Antetokounmpo. I mean, how do you stop a near seven-footer who's got some dribble skills like that? And that streaking rack attack is the mobile one drive. The aggressive take there to get inside. They're looking to make things happen to try and take control of this game. Hunter can't get it to go. That's not going to make you a favorite target of your teammates. They'll think twice about feeding you if you're going to keep missing layups. Here's Anadokounmpo. Rebound by Mr. Clutch. Uh, for him, it's harder to miss that shot than it is to make that shot. I think he was anticipating a bit of a bump there. And it's good. Two points. Good move for Hunter to get to the inside, and he just navigated the defense well. Pass to Matthews. Here's Middleton. Fires the three. Matthews' shot is good. And keeping everyone involved early. Now, that typically pays dividends. Yeah, and he's so-so from there, but when he's hitting from deep, it's a big confidence builder. B.A., the one-hand dunk just looks so fluid. Yeah, and absolutely. Even smooth when he's powering at home like that. Now here's Middleton. And here in the first, about three minutes in. Back to Holiday. And he'll draw the foul. He'll head to the line for two. And the reliability of what Drew Holiday brings to the hardwood. It's about that menacing defense night after night with great hands and great. That's good from Holiday. Well, Brent, after years of being an elite defender, Holiday is finally getting the recognition he deserves. And the best part of guys like this, B.A., is that ask other guards around the league what it's like to introduce your offensive game to a guy like Drew Holiday. They will tell you he's one of the best perimeter defenders that you're going to find. Here's Mr. Clutch. Good. I love this approach. Getting him involved early, and it's already paying off. Well, he's going to just keep going now. That's early confidence for him. Now here's Allen. Portis, right side. And the Bucks miss again. Yeah, my expectations were that he was not going to miss that one. He handles that kind of defense, especially on the inside. And Young gets it to go. Yeah, you could tell Hunter knew he was open, did not hesitate to find him. Milwaukee in the lead. Pass to Allen. Now Portis. And here's Middleton. Hunter covering. Here's Lopez. Capella with a rebound. His touch from mid-range, that's almost always good. That won't shake his confidence. Here's Mr. Clutch, defended by Portis. Here's Mr. Clutch. Back to Young. Pass to Capella. Down to five on the shot clock. From deep. From beyond the arc, and then some. He's got seven. Well, Capella at that size really has no issues spotting the open man. Now here's Allen. Middleton with it. There's the three. Capella with a rebound. A minute four left to play in the first quarter. Murray passes to Hunter. And it's good for two. Hunter's got his second bucket of the night. Getting enough shots in close to play inside out. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. Here's Atlanta with the ball. They're on a 13-5 run. Pass to Mr. Clutch. Now Young. They kick it out to Murray. Here's Mr. Clutch, defended by Portis. Here's Hunter. And it falls for him. He's hit three of his first four attempts. Always fun to look at. Not tremendously efficient, but the floater. Boy, those sure are pretty. Middleton finds Portis. Outside Holiday. Middleton with it. Hunter covering. Allen against Murray. Now here's Holiday. Not a lot of room. That one no good. Excellent D there from Capella. Outside Hunter. And 
Down it goes. Dunked it through off a beautiful setup. This small advantage is starting to snowball. Yeah, this team is looking to add to the lead, trying to put the other team away, and threatening here. And so it's the Atlanta Hawks closing out this quarter with a seven-point lead. And their defense has stood out, wreaking havoc for the opposition. And more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way right after this. Grant, we always talk about great footwork for post players, but how about perimeter players? You know, I'm glad you brought that up, B.A. Great perimeter players have elite footwork. The footwork helps to create the opportunity to score, whether that's shooting a three off the dribble or even in the post-up. Great, elite, fantastic, iconic guards who could do it all have superior footwork. Believe that. Hawks know they can be better than the AFC. They now have an expectation of a playoff caliber ball club. A decent passer for a point guard, not traditional. I'd like to see George Hill keep on making good, decisive plays like that. A nice shot by Young. And I absolutely love the attack mentality, <laughs> even with the bigger defender on him. Yeah, that's an awesome finish there. For the Bucks sure. making a switch here. Matthews checked in. Milwaukee has gone one of two from deep in the second quarter. Pass to Connaughton. Connects from downtown. Connaughton's gotten himself going here. His first points of the game on the deep ball. Outside Holiday. Outside Bogdanovich. Young from long range. Offensive rebound. Collins. And he was fouled in the act of shooting. Opportunity for a three-point play here. How about Collins cleaning up the glass? That time he is a premier rebounder. Well, after being drafted 19th overall in the 2017 draft, John Collins continuing to exceed expectations, which has contributed to what he does in terms of his workload. Collins has developed into much more than an athletic role man, Brent. Yeah, you're right, B.A. The fact that he only attempted one three-pointer in college and now is just letting him go here in the league. The guy is an efficient scorer from everywhere on the floor. Here's Matthews. And he's going for the oop here. They like to use Giannis in the pick-and-roll situations. He's getting better and better at understanding how to set the screens. But a rolling target, boy, he's a good one. Pass to Okongwu. And here's Bogdanovich. Holiday with the ball. Releases from 15. And the call will be against John Collins. That's his first foul of the game. Murray's checked in for Atlanta. Brooke Lopez is checked in for Milwaukee. Now to hear from our reporter, Ali LaForce. Well, guys, the continuity for the Bucks is a strength. Chris Middleton said, quote, we've been through every type of situation, so you know what to expect. There's no need to worry about failing because you know what you need to do. Connaughton outside. Here's Hill. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. It's going to go on Bogdan Bogdanovich. And he knocks down the first one. Well, George Hill is a gear-shifting, versatile guard and has some size and a good perimeter defender with that length. Chris Middleton's checked in for the Bucks. Drew Holiday comes in for Connaughton. And so he makes both from the line. Two-part equation. You have to be aggressive enough to get to the line, then talented enough to sink them. Pass to Hunter. Back to Murray. Shot to end the cold streak. And that's two points on the layup. And the Hawks lead by four. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. Anadokupo finds Hill. Here's Holiday. Up top, Lopez. Lopez. 
On to Kumpo, outside. Count that one. He's now five for eight. Making shots against good defense, that's what great NBA players have to do consistently. And if you want to be elite, which Giannis is, that's a prerequisite. Pass to Kaminsky. Back to Murray. Kaminsky outside. Outside Murray. Over Holiday. And there's Murray. That one's good. And the assist by Kaminsky. Murray's got four points this quarter. Anna Kumpo with it. Ten points for him. Can't connect from 13 feet out. And so a close game as we wrap up the first half of play. The Hawks on top, leading by four. All right, now let's check in with Allie LaForce. Allie, what do you have? Well, John, you're facing a challenge tonight. What's been the key to this lead in the first half? Um, I think following through with our game plan. Uh, I think we knew it was going to be a tough night tonight. Solid team, um, short roster. Uh, so we knew we are going to have to come out and um, bring the edge competitively. They knew the scouting report. Guys? Appreciate it, Allie. And we'll be coming right back after this break, ready for the third quarter. And we're halfway through this one. Plenty of basketball left in a game that's been a fairly even one. You look at Giannis Antetokounmpo. What a contribution. He's been dominating down low. Gotta assume they'll keep feeding him the rock. Oh, man, pouring it on right now. And why wouldn't you? The tandem on the perimeter, Murray and Hunter. Then it's Trey Young. Then there's John Collins. And it's Mr. Clutch in at the four-man position. So that's who Nate McMillan starts the second half with. The Bucks trail. You know, and where the Bucks seem to dominate every year is on the glass, particularly at the defensive end. Number one in the league the last four seasons. And Grant, I guess for the Bucks, hey, you can't teach size. And they're good fundamentally as well, VA. I mean, they block out, they fight to maintain position. If you're going to beat them, it probably won't be with second chance points. Free throw good from Middleton. And so he hits both. And Middleton also capable of preventing points at the other end, Brent. And I think this progression of Middleton having that length and switchability along with experience is helping him build that defensive resume. He'll hit the defensive glass. Just a terrific all-around player. Defensively, you can't afford to get stuck on the pick. That's one that the coaches will watch tomorrow with that player. You hate to see him give up in that situation. Now here's Holiday. Middleton outside. Lopez in the post. Collins defending. And Lopez gets it to go. Feeling more and more comfortable in this offense. That's just Chris Middleton making a play. Pass to Mr. Clutch. Now Hunter. Over Middleton. Hunter can't get it to go. Holiday against Young. Holiday passes to Middleton. Here's Matthews. Now here's Ana Kumpo. Six to shoot. Oh, that doesn't go on the chance to tie. To the wing, right side. Here's Young. Rejected by Lopez. Excellent off ball awareness as Brooke was able to get over there and swatted away on the wing holiday pass to Ana de Kumpo this for the tie and he sinks the layup Ana de Kumpo has got 12 points in the game every night Giannis steps out there you gotta feel like you got a good chance to win timeout called the Hawks here's Young can't connect from 13 feet out. And so it's Atlanta ending the quarter up 10. They're communicating well and stringing together stops. Back to the game after this break.
And let's take this opportunity to show you our State Farm assist to the game. Now, I know he's a big man, but he's got some point guard in him if he's making passes like this. Now the passing for the team becoming contagious, this time involving the big. Here's Holiday, and that comes off the assist by Middleton. Middleton's got three assists tonight. Well, you're kind of asking for it. Drew Holiday gets in that close. He's probably scoring. Now on to Kumpo. Six to shoot. Over Murray. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pick. The first free throw is good. First, of course, MJ. It just tells you Giannis is already an all-time great. Shoots over Collins. And that one's good. Middleton. Here's Ante de Kumpo. And Ante de Kumpo with the stuff. This is when the defense really gets disrupted by Giannis being physical. And then he gets up in the air to rub it in with the jam. Here's Mr. Clutch. And count it. Now five for seven. A little over two and a half minutes have passed here in the fourth. Now here's Ante de Kumpo. The D's right on him. And the basket by Holiday. Yeah, I'm looking over at the coaching staff. Smiles on their face. That's what they want. Holiday very skilled at getting to that spot and hitting a J. That one's good for two. And the Hawks lead by five. With a tough road ahead, they worked hard to get a good shot. The Hawks shooting an efficient 57% tonight. And he lobs it up top. And Collins with the slam. Yeah, when Collins gets up there like that, look out. For Milwaukee, they've gotten four shots out of six attempts to drop so far in the fourth. And the basket by Holiday. And really, that is a tremendous shot by Holiday there. His team really has momentum now. And the Hawks call time here. Now here's Murray. They get it back. Count it. And how about that hoop? The guard, Trey Young, getting inside and mixing it up a bit. Timeout called the Bucks. Nice shot there, making him 8 for 13. Bucks, they're shooting just 42% so far in the game. And the shot goes down. Pass to Mr. Clutch. Now here's Hunter. Middleton covering. Puts it up from 17. And it's good as he snugs it right through the net. Now here's Ana de Kumpo. Misses from short range. Got to appreciate the aggressive defense he brings. Well, it's about the defensive end, and that's what guys feed off. He gives the effort down there at all times. They've been battling all night. Now they're on the brink of putting this game away. No, great job of getting in position to win a game. It's been an all-out effort from the squad. Anadokounmpo. Another miss by Anadokounmpo. And the Hawks with possession here. They've led by as much as 10. And the slam dunk by Capella. You got to give them respect. They're doing everything they can to close this out. We love that the guys are staying aggressive late in this ball game, just not wanting to let go of the rope. Got it. Well, you have to do way more than that to stop the MVP. Giannis just determined. Outside Young. So this one belongs to the Hawks. This one was in the balance right until the final second. NBA, they showed their character when it mattered most, sending those fans home happy. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Big event. Trey, this is a young team. Talk about the chemistry and the connection and how you play together. Uh, I mean, you, you're around us outside of the locker room. I mean, you can tell why we, why we support each other so well and the energy we have for each other on the court. I mean, it, you can tell the reason why we do that. And, uh, I mean, I love this group. The connection is there on and off the court. Guys? Allie, thank you as always. And that'll wrap it up, folks. For Brent Berry, Allie LaForce, and Grant Hill, this is Brian Anderson thanking you for tuning in. So long, everyone.